Hi, I'm Ryan from Ryan's Guitar Stuff, and today's video is a Unity Blackstar bass amp. This is the 30 watt version, and I'm going to run through some sounds on this, and yeah, we'll get into it. So, I'm using the Marcus Miller V7. This is the second gen version of the bass, and yeah, that's just a heads up of what I'm using. I'm not using active controls, I'm on the complete passive, so it gives the. So, you don't have an active before. You don't have preamp for preamp, if that makes sense. Um, so, yeah. So I'm gonna go quickly through each of the sounds. So, I have a set to classic, just the demo of the classic sound. I have the EQ dialed at noon, the frequency dialed at noon, highs dialed at noon, and lows dialed at noon. And the gain's about eight o'clock, and the master is about 10 o'clock. So that's just a reference, and I'll get into it. So that's classic sound, now for the modern sound. There are the three voice channels in the amp. Next, I'm going to show you the compressor, which is a really nice compressor. So, so it kind of tightens everything up, makes the volume just slightly more equal, and it's a really nice compressor that's built into the amp. Next, I'm going to show you the chorus. And what out? The really nice chorus in this as well. Oddly enough, I'm, I haven't seen many choruses on bass lamps. I've seen more like flanger, octaves, that kind of stuff. It's nice to see a chorus for a change. Yeah, and just to show you how powerful the EQ is on this, um, this is the Lowe's cut. And the Lowe's cranked. So, put the Lowe's back at 12. Mids scooped. Frequencies pumped. Uh, sorry, mids pumped, and then I'll do a frequency pass in the second again. So. And now, I'll put that back at 12, and now to do the highs. So the highs scooped. It's a really versatile amp. I've been looking for a bass amp for a while, and I think this might be the one. Compressor is on, chorus is on. That minus 10 decibels. Because I can drive the gain a bit more, but also keep the same EQ. Uh, that same EQ, same volume, which is really nice. So, here's how I would set up this sound for myself for that riff I've been playing throughout this. So, 
switch this off. It's a really nice amp. It can go very loud. That's the gain at 12 with minus 10 decibel switch engaged with the master about 10 o'clock. So it has a lot of gain on top and a lot of volume on top. So I've been Ryan for Ryan's guitar stuff and see you next time. Bye.